Hey, how's it going? My voice is a little thrashed right now. Did uh, a couple karaoke songs. Songs, yes. Um, when my voice wasn't really in the condition to do it, and the last one was really a thrashy kind of song, so um, I had a good time though. So anyway, someone was wanting me to watch a video of someone complaining about how you know they think SJWs have have ruined gaming and they're just giving up on gaming altogether and they're blaming the SJWs for it and I got I, I got about 17 minutes into the video and, and I'm just I'm just getting so frustrated because he can't give a single example of, of games that have been ruined by this you know the whole whole time he gives this he brings up a piece of art and um and talks about how this piece of art it was censored out of a, and, it, and it was t removed from a gallery because some people were complaining. It's just like, okay, just what the hell does that have to do with the games? Okay, he's saying, oh, he just doesn't, they, 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 he just doesn't enjoy the games anymore. Well, that does, that's not the fault of the SJWs. That's the fault of the companies. Not, not they're run, they've run out of ideas. Game pump, game companies have run out of ideas. There's, there's no getting around that. Okay, and they're just regurgitating the same old shit over and over again. I've been, I haven't really liked the gaming industry for about 12 years. Okay, 12 years is, is, is you know, when they really, 12 years ago is when the last, you know, really decent innovations in gameplay and uh, concepts you know, that's about how long it's been since we've had anything really truly new and interesting. Everything else is, you know, just a continuation. It's, it's refining. And once you see, once you see that for what it is, it's boring. It's just fucking boring. But then you're going to turn around and blame the SJWs for it? They're one of the least significant reasons why the ga why games have become boring. Why games they're, they're just dull. There's nothing that really that new. Okay. SJWs are not the reason for that. Okay, and, and and if people can if people can start giving examples of uh, you know games that have games that have come out but have been ruined by SJWs. You know, go go for it to talk about them in this video. Um, one one person in, in, in another video of mine made comments saying, "Oh well, there there is a, a game company that uh, hired based off of uh, the uh, basically they hired based off of the progressive stack." I'm like, um, "What does this? I mean, so one so a company did hiring practices based off of that. What does that have to do?" with the games that are created. What games have been ruined by this? Well, nobody's going to be able to give an answer for it. No one's going to give me an example because they probably don't exist. It just has to well, those, well, games were, were stopped from being made. Okay, prove it. Prove that it's the SJW's fault and not just because the, the game companies thought it might not, you know, maybe it wouldn't sell that many. I mean, this this shit's ridiculous. The way that some people are talking about this this is this is creating trying to create a boogeyman beyond just it's it's ridiculous. Um, I'll leave a link to the guy's video. I I have only watched 17 minutes of it so far. I'm going to continue to try to watch more of it, but it's frustrating because he's not giving any examples. I think he's 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 bought this idea. He's bought into the idea that it's the SJW's fault. That that's that that's what's ruined gaming and it's just it's it's sad to see that kind of boogeyman be built up so fucking huge it's sad he's i'm him giving up on gaming fine give up on gaming because you've become bored with it but don't do this stupid blaming shit it's stupid